Once the biopsy is complete, a specially trained doctor called a pathologist will examine the tissue or fluid samples for abnormal or cancerous cells. Pathology reports can take one to two weeks to complete. The wait can be a real challenge, but being able to make an informed decision regarding your treatment is well worth your time. Remember, the pathology report helps give a full picture of your situation. A core needle biopsy sample provides information on the tumor type and the tumor's growth rate, or grade, which we discussed in subchapter 3.2. If cancer is found, the pathologist will also test the cells for estrogen or progesterone receptors. When a lumpectomy, or wide local surgical biopsy, is performed, the results provide information on the type, grade, and receptor status of the tumor. It can also measure the distance between the surrounding normal tissue and the excised tumor. This distance, called the margin, shows whether the site is clear of cancer cells or not. A positive margin means cancer cells are present at the margin of the tumor. A negative margin means there are no tumor cells at the margin. A close margin means that the distance between the tumor and the normal surrounding tissue is less than about 3 millimeters, 0.118 inch. Using the pathology report and any additional scans or blood work, the cancer is classified into stages. Your medical team will use this information to design the best plan for you. But before we discuss treatment options in Chapter 6, we will elaborate on the types and stages of cancer.